How old are viewers? What's up? It is Penowitz9 coming at you with a new video. I apologize right now because I am currently sick. Ha! Huh. Okay. And today we're going to be cleaning basically all of my paintbrushes. So basically we're going to be cleaning all of my paintbrushes that I use for painting. And they're kind of nicely organized, so yeah. So I had to look up how to properly clean paintbrushes because I had no idea. So you need warm water and soap and you need something to get in between the bristle and this is what I have and that's probably for cats but we don't use it on our cats so I'm going to use it for my paintbrushes. Um, so let's start with the obvious ones and I'm going to start with these. Big brushes right here, not all of them's been oh, maybe all of them's been used. So I'm gonna start with my big brushes right here. So I'm gonna quickly change my position and then we'll get right into cleaning these and I'll show you how to clean them. So I'm gonna use these and this might be a very short video, who knows? I might do all my brushes just because to make it longer for 10 minutes. I don't know. So here we are <laughs> at my sink with all of this stuff here. So yeah, I still apologize for my voice in here. I'm gonna start with these ones, so these ones over here, and so have some warm water. So have some warm water, and basically, since these are so old, I have no idea if they're gonna work, but we're gonna try. So start off with the thing. Oh no, oh no, don't fall. Phone, don't fall. I'll be right back because I need to change my phone positioning. Okay, I found a little better of a positioning because my camera is going to fall out of my tripod, so I don't want that. And as we were saying, we're going to turn on. Oh, that's not so hot. We're going to basically put it on warm, put it in nice and soaked, and then put soap in it. Uh, I'm probably going to go get some dish soap used because that'll probably be a little better. So basically, I'm going to try to get all the old growth paint out with just my fingers. So basically next I'm going to take this and just kind of put it in between the brushes. I don't think it, it may not work. Ow, scratch my foot, that's pointy. So I'll be right back. I'm going to quickly grab something um, to kind of dry the brushes off. I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. I grabbed a lot of paper towel. Uh, basically, we're going to keep doing this process until I feel like maybe all the paint's out. It might not all come out, but it might just make the brushes a bit better to work with. And I'm going to keep repeating this process with all the other brushes, and I'll get back to you on that. So let's uh, do a quick speed of this. So, okay, uh, it seems like most of the paint got out. I might have still some left in there, but I really don't have the proper tool to actually get in here because like I said, this is more for cats. So if you guys can find something that gets in between, uh, that would be nice. But for now we have this and it's not too bad. Hopefully it doesn't harden. Um, I'm just gonna stick it in here for now. Uh, I forget how to actually let these dry but I'm gonna let this dry over here for now. There's still some pink left in it but hopefully it's fine. I'm actually gonna move the iPad because I just realized it might be a little bit of a distraction. So I'm gonna move it over to my window and we're gonna continue with the process. <laughs> this doesn't work by the way. So let's continue on with this process. Oh you're crunchy. <laughs> So I'm going to quickly grab um, some dish soap. Maybe that would be a little more better than actual hand soap. So I'll be like right back there. So I'm using Dolly dish soap. Hopefully that works. 
the shadow. Goodbye, shadow. Ooh. Ooh, that does work. Ooh, that works better. Ooh, it works better than regular hand soap. Ooh, lemon. Ow, ow, burning my hands. Ow. Okay, that was maybe a little bit better. Didn't get all the colors out. I'm just trying to get the old dirty paint out of it. That's all I'm basically doing. But that seems to kind of work a little bit better than hand soap. So I'm just gonna rewash these two. I just remember how to dry paintbrushes properly. You flip them over somewhere, so I'm gonna just flip them behind me. And that's where my tub's at, so still haven't got the colors out. Now we're gonna go to the last two and I'm just gonna combine these two together and then we'll move on those out of the way to these brushes right here. Uh, not all of them's been used, but I'm just gonna clean them all to the best of my abilities. No, no fall. So let's get right into it. Mm. Oh, it's so tough. I'm just getting started. Now I've been living to brushes and I use the same paint brushes so a lot of these brushes do need to be cleaned and a lot of them are not that bad like this one and I don't usually use these ones so I might just throw them away or I might just keep them for another day uh, I don't use these ones either so these ones are fine uh, these ones are fine uh, yeah I don't usually use that one that much but I might clean it anyways uh, these ones seem to be fine so these ones I will just leave in here here, but there are a lot in here that I do need to clean um, so I'll take out these two and I'll leave these over on the side here so these two I am cleaning out so I'll leave them right here and I'll just kind of start placing things back into place so I'm just gonna quickly pick out the brushes that severely need to be cleaned and just leave the ones in here fine so, so I gotta be really careful here because since I do have a lot of these these can fall into the sink like that oh my lord <laughs> okay so okay I got another jar here and now I'm gonna sit I'm gonna move some objects I'm gonna move all these over here I'm gonna sit this here just in case and let's start with cleaning some more paintbrushes
literally just clean all of my brushes right now. Oh my throat's starting to hurt. I'm gonna go get some ginger ale in a minute. But there's one brush that I didn't clean. Um, as you can see here, hopefully you guys can know. So this brush uh, is kind of a bit messed. So basically I'm not gonna try to even clean this. So this will be my dauber brush. So basically where I just basically daub stuff on. So I'm not gonna clean this one because I can't really, cause it's like really packed in tightly. So I'm just gonna leave you there and I'm gonna clean up everything and end this video. So I'll be right back. So I hope you guys did enjoy this video. Leave a like, comment and subscribe to my channel. Hit the bell to keep up to date. I apologize for my voice. I am sick. I had a sore throat and I couldn't breathe and I'm losing sleep. This is stupid daytime savings. I swear to God, that's what it is. Better, I think. I should stop talking because my throat is about to hurt and I need to drink some ginger ale. <laughs> Welcome to Canada. Follow me on all my social media because I like to keep you up to date with all my stuff. I have Instagram, I have Snapchat, I have Twitter, I have this and that. Also, I have a Patreon account and a Twitch account. I have not posted anything on it. I did a little bit of a live stream just for a test. That was about it. I didn't do anything else with that. So follow my Instagram, especially because I do polls and I ask you guys questions and what you guys want. Not a lot of you like to respond to me. I want to interact with you, but you don't interact with me. What's the point? I don't know. I'm nice. I don't know how to end this video because I kind of left myself in an awkward position. Anyways, yeah, see you later guys. Hope I'm better in the next video. Bye.